we've talked about Tua, but this offense that Mike McDaniel is running, and I saw this in practice for two days against the Bucs, a lot of short area stuff, run after the catch. This is the essence of a Kyle Shanahan offense that Mike Daniel's going to run. Mike McDaniel's going to run. Mike McDaniel, the head coach, is going to be the play caller. He's running an old school West Coast offense, which is short passes, run after the catch principles. Tyree Kill, there's not going to be a lot of passes for over 20 yards. But what I saw is short area, get him going, get the cheetah going. And he was incredible, man. One-on-ones, he beat the, the, the Buccaneer corners repeatedly. And he could still run. He's lost absolutely nothing at the wide receiver position. See, see the Dolphins here, if they could protect, their offensive line is very average. They've had all sorts of issues. In fact, they're going to have at least three new starters. That's the thing for this thing. Protect Tua. It's going to be a lot of short drops. Get it out of his hands quickly. Two of those receivers. And they're really good, man. They're very talented. I'm not saying they're going to win a division. We know the Bills are the favorite. But do not be surprised if the Dolphins challenge the Bills in the AFC East. They have a very good roster. The, the problem is not the roster. It's the quarterback and whether Tua could play consistent football. It's a smaller frame guy. He's not real big. Not, not going to wire his arm strength. It's a lot of run after the catch stuff. This offense, I'll tell you what, Jimmy Garoppolo made – a Super Bowl and a championship game within this offense. So I think this actually fits them really well. 